Yeah, I guess it's recording. All right, so this is my review of the Specialized Tarmac Expert SL6. Just get it out of the truck so y'all can see a picture. Now, I've made some upgrades. I know it's a brand new bike and I've already done stuff to it, but I'm hoping that the wind here doesn't Booger things up too bad. All right, let's switch this shit around. All right, this is the Specialized Tarmac Expert disc. These are not the stock wheels that come on it, or the stock tires, or the stock seat, or the stock crank, or the stock chain rings, or the pedals, bottle cages, Brake rotors, rear cassette. I've basically almost turned this bike into an S-Works bike. Like a Dura-Ace front and rear mech and shifters and a carbon bar. And then the only difference is gonna be the frame at that point. It's a... Uh, I could have bought an S-Works bike and I'd have been in it the same money. But I wouldn't have this cool ass paint job if I got the S-Works. So I like the paint. It's kind of the reason I got the bike to begin with. Walked in. This is the one that grabbed me. Uh, love the bike. Can't say... Can't say enough good about it. Sorry, awkward pause. I just realized that uh, my frame has marks in it from getting sat in a trainer that I never sat it in because I don't have that kind of trainer. Huh. Guess the bike shop is buying me a new frame. Cool. <clears throat> Anyway, sorry to get off on a little tangent there, but this bike is badass. Now, I'm not a small guy. Right now, I am... Oops, sorry. Back the truck is still dirty from all the crap from the race. 250-something. I ride this bike. Ride the shit out of it. Love it. Nothing's broke, nothing's gone out of true. I have only done run one race on these tires and wheels because these are going to be my race wheels. And I won't ride the bike again with those on it until the next race. I'll put the stock wheels and tires on. Although the stock wheels and tires are phenomenal. These are just, they're just better in virtually every way. They're lighter. The tires roll better. Just going to these wheel, this, these wheels, tires, uh, the brakes, and cassette. There was a five eighths of a pound difference in the bike, so the bike is now sitting at sixteen six, how it currently is, and that'll be right around. Um, what will it get down to? Be almost right at sixteen. By changing the rest of the group set to Dura-Ace. And there's front and rear Mac, the shifters. And the brake calipers. Beyond that, I'm really not sure what I want to change. Because, oh, carbon bar maybe. Make it a little nicer to ride. Because I've done everything that has rotating weight. It would almost be silly to start throwing money just to reduce the weight of the frame of the bike. Now, if I went out and put 100 miles on an S-Works frame, 
and I felt that it was truly better, not just lighter. Uh, well, then that might be another story. All right, well, that's all. Later, bye.